I told Simmons here, I try to give folks time. I told them, hey, go ahead, take this. I'm not that secure with my Southern football. But I give me time to rehearse, give me time to read and investigate. I can come up with some real quick shit. So all the keyboard warriors, I want you to go ahead and crack your knuckles, get your Gatorade ready, get your Haterade ready because it's about to get on. I want you at your top because this shit right here, they about to piss you off. Florida Memorial. Two and nine, Florida Memorial. I had no clue who the hell this team was. They should not even charge y'all tickets for this damn game. This is a glorified spring practice. This is basically, yeah, no. We're not even gonna discuss this game. LSU, LSU was basically returning the favor to Southern for allowing them to use their stadium for practice while Death Valley was under construction. And for that return of favor, they're gonna give you a big check and send you back to South Baton Rouge with an ass whooping. I'm looking at LSU by 30. Texas Southern. Revenge game, right? My heart wants to say TSU because I know the offensive firepower. My mind is telling me Eric Dooley will keep Andrew Body off the damn field. Three yards in a cloud of dust. Because TSU cannot stop the run. <sighs> Southern, that one by seven. Pine Bluff, Southern by 15. If you think Prairie View is going to come over there and be at home and beat Dooley, you lost your mind. Southern's going to get revenge against Prairie View. I have Southern at this point being 4-1. and one. Another home game against Alcorn, which I'm not sure how this works out with the swag because they played Alcorn at home last year, but they play them at home again this year. So, this will be also Eric Dooley getting his revenge because Alcorn beat uh, Prairie View last year. So I have Southern being 5-1. and one. We're not going to talk about them playing the uh, Harry Potters over there. Dragons. That's 6-1. and one. Now we're going to get to the game. The meat of their schedule. Jackson State. On paper. Jackson State has no business. No matter who the hell signs where tomorrow. Today, on paper, they have no business business losing to Southern. They have the better receiving core, the better quarterback, they have the better D-line D on paper. Paper. Look, keyboard warrior, I said paper. Backspace. Back, backspace? Thank you. They have the best secondary. We can't, we can't argue that shit. Linebacker core? Eh. Defensive coach? You definitely. And they had a bigger crowd. This is the last game before they play the next two in Birmingham. What does that mean? It's going to be another close game. I really do think Jackson will win this game just as of right now. February 1st. I have Jackson winning 35 to 20. No. Yeah, 35 15. Next week, they go to FAMU. I really do think Southern will get better once they get these two off their schedule, especially back to back. Because this rivalry is not going to be away. I, I don't think Sutter's going to win this game. Um, as of now, 
things can change. But right now, I have family who winning that game about the same. Let's say 32-15. Valley is the third best team in the Eastern Division. Fight me on it. Valley will beat Southern at Southern. And it will be a close game. There will be exactly two fights in this game. Maybe three. Maybe three fights. So if you pay attention, have Southern losing one to LSU, Jackson State, FAMU, LSU, Jackson State, FAMU, and Valley. So that's a win versus Florida Memorial, Texas Southern, Pine Bluff, and them, Alcorn, uh, Harry Potter's team, and I have them beating Grambling. So Southern will end up with a 7 and 4 schedule. All right, keyboard warriors, do your worst. Tell me a new asshole. Tell me how wrong I am. I know you want to. Y'all have a wonderful day.